Hello, hello, veggie fam. It's your girl, Ashley of Verbalist Veggies, coming to you with another Test Tuesday. And this week, you clicked on the thumbnail because you saw that Ghetto Gastro now has these like Pop-Tart toaster strudel things. They call them toaster pastries. Yeah, and I got the strawberry flavor. We had to give them a try. It's giving nostalgia. Love that they're vegan. So let's get into it. And if this is your first time tuning in, thank you guys so much. This is how we do take a vegan plant-based product we taste test it we give a star rating and we wrap up the video at the end because why spend that money honey why spend that money honey if you don't have to i'll do it for you also shout out to all the veggie fam that stay in touch with me each and every week this is how you can reach me too follow me on my socials yes make sure to follow me here for day-to-day -day updates and things but let's get into this review that's why you're here shall we and boom taking a closer look honey it is beautiful i love this image here i mean it's just popping out at you love the strawberries in the bag like so vibrant and i love it just looks clean and gets to the point love that about them now let's get into these main ingredients honey all right we gonna do the top five and then y'all can see the rest that's why i get this close okay so we have enriched unbleached wheat flour strawberry filling Okay, we have sugar, coconut oil, and then um, they say natural flavor. You know, I never know what they mean by that. But then it gets into the rest, you know, probably some binders and things to hold it together. Okay, be warned if you have any allergies, it has wheat and coconut in it. Okay, now we're going to see about these cooking instructions. Okay, so they say the pastries are already fully cooked and ready to eat as is. Stop playing with me. I really thought I was gonna have to put this in the oven. <laughs> it's already ready to eat. Oh my God, y'all, I don't, I don't think I've ever come across a product like this that we did not have to put in the oven. Okay, um, remove pastry from foil, toast on lowest setting, let pastry cool. Oh, okay, Never mind. I wonder if I should try it ready as is. I think I'm gonna try it ready as is because if it's fire, it don't matter, right? I mean, it's fully cooked. So let's just open a box. Look at me talking to myself. Hold on, let's open a box. <laughs> okay, so when we open it, it has three in there. Or is it four? Looks like it has four. Oh, I'll get back into this too. I completely forgot about that. Y'all, that really threw me. Okay, so this is <laughs> what the package looks like. Y'all, that really threw me. I didn't know it was ready to eat. Okay probably well okay it's real vibrant we'll get a little of this i don't want to make a mess but that's what it look like okay let's get into the calories too because i completely forgot about that so okay so for the calories okay you get one pastry in a serving four servings in the container we got 200 calories for it okay and for the sodium only 110 milligrams okay let's just get to the taste test this is so interesting okay stay tuned Okay, we back with it you already know we got the little tiny mic we're here for it um because yeah the air will kick in okay we know how it goes we're in a hot place we are thankful for the air so we ain't gonna play them like that okay so <laughs> oh and i sent the hoops out because y'all don't want to hear this now that's irrelevant i know i'm rambling so let's get into this review here is what it looks like i mean it's really pink i kind of split it um, on here, but you can kind of see, look how pink that is. Okay. The bottom is kind of like this. I can only imagine um, if you toast it, it'll probably give it an even more kind of color change. You know what I'm saying? But we're going to try it out since they said it's ready to eat out the package. You know, like a true 90s kid who used to eat these on the go and call it breakfast. Let's get into it. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna get some water, but hold on. <laughs> okay, my mind is kind of blown here. Um, I had to, you know, I didn't want to keep chewing on the camera. And also, you know, you always need a little water because we're doing a lot of chatting, okay? So let's go ahead 
ahead and get into these things that I love, okay? Let's break this down. So, I love that this really tastes like a Pop-Tart. And it's blowing my mind because it really tastes like the strawberry one I remember from back in the day. And that's what's throwing me in a good way because I was shooketh, I wasn't ready. Okay, so that, that right there is there. I love that the filling tastes like strawberry jam, almost like a preserve, you know? Really good, it's really, really good. Um, the crust or the uh, actual pastry kind of just melts in your mouth. It's a good time, I like this, wow. I like this. Uh, we can slide into the love me nots, you know, um, just to be, I don't know, could I be petty or not? I don't know. Uh, the only thing is, you know, it does get a little crumbly. So you, you definitely need to have like a vessel to hold these things because crumbs, gon they gonna go places, okay? So, you know, just know it's, it's more of a crumbly type of pastry, you know what I'm saying? So just prepare for that, probably keep it in a package if you're on the go, because you don't want it to go everywhere. But with that being said, shout out to y'all. I'm so proud of y'all. First off, I'm proud of y'all. You know, I already got their other product. Check out their other video that I did a review on. Um, there's the little thumbnail so y'all can just, you know, I don't know how to do the click thing, but just find it, okay, in my Test Tuesday <laughs> playlist. But I'm just supportive of this group. But irregardless of that, this product itself, because, you know, if y'all want to sponsor me, go ahead. But uh, they, they have not yet. They ain't found me yet. That's what we're going to claim. Um, but <laughs> with that being said, the star rating, I'm going to just give it four stars. It's right there, a uh, four stars. And this is a solid pastry. Um, I know I'm not a typical Pop-Tart kind of girl, you know. Uh, I really got to crave a sweet. But if I'm craving something sweet, I would get this. Yes. Shout out to them. Let's get into the wrap up. <laughs> hey y'all, it's the wrap up. What do we think? Comment below if you'll give this product a try. If you've tried it before, hit me up, let me know. And thank you guys so much for tuning in. With you girl, Ashley of Brother Liz Veggies, where we're always cooking up fresh greens on a daily. Again, here are all of my socials to stay up to date with me throughout the week. And thank you guys so much for watching.